I just backed way too much with this. So tough. <laughs> hey y'all, it's me Chris, and I want to tell you about my time in Albuquerque. Yay! <laughs> So last weekend, I went to Albuquerque, New Mexico on kind of a random whim. A friend of mine about a month ago was like, hey, I'll be in the area if you want to come down. Like, that's cool. And I'm like, okay, I will. And so I was going to drive. It's only about a 10-hour road trip. And I was like, okay, I could go, like, see the desert and go. But then she was like, oh, there's a cheap airline that goes to, like, random places, but they go from LAX to Albuquerque, which is the closest international. Oh, doesn't really need to be international, but the closest big airport that is next to me. So I looked up the flight and it was only a hundred bucks. Like at most, it was what I spent on tickets was a hundred and ten. And it's Allegiant Airline. I'll link their website below, but it was really cool because they do one ways and they only fly certain days, but man, they're just their tickets are super cheap and it's one of those airlines where you do have to pay for like all the bags and everything but at the same time like if you're military discount like this guy bags were free and so that's nice and also I mean every airline nowadays you have to pay for a bag so it's like apples and oranges so I booked the trip and then I went on my flight from LAX to Albuquerque um, and it was really cool because so the runway is like you take off towards the west and so to go east so to go towards Albuquerque we had to do a turn and it provided like this really cool like scenery of like the coastline and the beach and like the city so I'll insert a picture of that right here <laughs> So yeah, it was amazing, and so flew there. It was nighttime before I by the time I got there, and we went through a little bit of turbulence and clouds and weather, but it was fine. And then got there, and it was okay. So so a little bit of premise on my thoughts on Albuquerque before I went there. I did not think anything of it. Uh, honestly, it's a flyover city to me. I, I didn't know, didn't do any research on it. My friend was pretty knowledgeable on the area, so I knew that, like, whatever she wanted to do, I was down, because, like, whatever new stuff. I just knew, um, the only thing I knew about Albuquerque was Breaking Bad, and it's in New Mexico, and it's one of the bigger cities in New Mexico. But beyond that, like, I had nothing, and... And it was pretty cool because when I showed up there, like, Albuquerque has a lot to offer. And it was cheap to get there to where, like, I wouldn't have experienced the stuff thinking, oh, I'm better than Albuquerque. No. Like, no. So, um, went there and I didn't take a lot of pictures or videos. I did a couple and you'll see towards the end. But mostly, I mean, it was all about nature uh, the gorgeous sceneries. I mean, from like the desert to like the river to like greenery. It was amazing. Like there was points where I did not think I was still in New Mexico. Like I'll insert a picture right here. Yeah, like that's Mexico. Oh, and this is one of the drives. Did a few things. Just basically drove around, tried to find one of these hot springs, but we like walked around for about a mile and then couldn't find it. Also, I, I started, so. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I wasn't really into walking around that day. Any other day I would have been fine. Um, let's see. And then, and then on that day, uh, we just basically drove around and we met, saw, went through like this caldera, which is super pretty and naturey and it was like awesome and they like it looked like someone lived there and it used to be a ranch and it, like it was it was uh featured on a couple like tv shows and movies uh that i can't think of at the moment but it was it was gorgeous it looked it looked like fucking wyoming like it was insane and then drove through that area up towards santa fe i got to see the state capitol picture here uh that's i'm a nerd about state capitol so i got to see that and then drove down and then back to albuquerque and then okay so food 
and beer there are essential and they're amazing. Another thing I didn't know about Albuquerque, which is like the list, is they're really big on local breweries. So I have an app that I'll talk about in another video, but when I searched local breweries, like at least 20 popped up in Albuquerque. And so I got to go to two of them, uh, Santa Fe Brewery. Uh, I didn't go to the one in Santa Fe. I went to the tasting room in Albuquerque, which was in this like cute little container park thing. And then I went to another brewing company that I can't think of the name at the moment, but it had like really bomb food. So in Albuquerque, I guess green chili is a big thing and green and red chili. Uh, I guess it's a New Mexico thing and they put it on everything. So a couple of friends of mine was like, oh, like, hey, you're going to New Mexico. You have to have a green chili cheeseburger or like, oh, eat green chili or green chili this. It's like. That's all they talked about. So yeah, had that. It was really good. Breaking Bad scenes. Uh, the car, the car wash, his house, which I didn't recognize was the house. Uh, it's been a while since I saw the TV show, but I love it. But and then I saw the like that point where um, the DEA agent, um, the brother-in-law, like he always does his little like talks in like this parking lot of this motel and drove past it and it was super cool because it was like right there so um, other than that I had like a Breaking Bad donut <music> had like a, a cookie ice cream sandwich I uh, had really good food enjoyed the scenery I sat at the bottom of Sandia Mountain and at the base of it and I was gonna go up and do the tram but it started lightning to where like they don't do that so ate at a restaurant at the base and just watched the like storm roll in and that was gorgeous and it was insane so yeah did a bunch of other things but to put everything i did would make the video way too long but yeah super cool so yeah i'll put the video and pictures of those things at the end of the video so moral of the story is go to places where you don't think much of it because it they offer a lot like I know that sounds really bougie and I hate saying that but at the same time it's like I didn't know that Albuquerque offered a lot and then it did and I got to go and explore it and see it and it was cool and green chili and beer and it was awesome so yeah yeah so go look up cheap flights and go have a a weekend of coolness and yes and thank you for watching i really appreciate you listening to Omni adventures have you ever been to albuquerque new mexico or santa fe or in that area uh if so tell me what i missed tell me what i hit on the nail um tell me what city i should explore next thank you for watching uh love y'all and bye